Hi guys, uh, my name's David, I'm from here at Sadia Plast Building Solutions and today is our first podcast and the first product we're talking about today is the very exciting uh, Guardian Home Extension and I have Ross here with me today who is a uh, Managing Director of the, the Guardian Warm Roof and the, and the Extension so I've been flooded with questions and uh, between builders and homeowners uh, around this system so I just thought we'd try something new and uh, sit down today uh, with Ross and kind of pick his brain about the Guardian Home Extension. So forgive us if we're not, <laughs> we haven't got all the answers, but yeah. this is new to me and Ross. So, uh, um, so yeah. Well, the Guardian Home Extension um, achieves probably the best U-value from an extension point of view. So it'll be the most thermally efficient um, extension on the marketplace right now. Uh, because of its slimline walls as well, it creates uh, uh, a lot of extra space whether it's garden space or internal space for furniture and stuff. Um, and probably the biggest aspect of it is the, is the speed that it, that, it, that it can be installed because it's, um, it's modular, it's, uh, it's prefabricated in our, uh, in our factory before it leaves. Um, it can be installed anywhere between two to three weeks, depending on what the square meterage is. Yeah, I, I think the most important thing is, is for the homeowners. The homeowners don't want builders in their house for three to six months or however long it's going to take. So exactly. the system just fits, everyone fits the builder because yeah. he gets more extensions done yeah. and the homeowner gets what they want quicker. 100% and probably from a homeowner's point of view as well, there's less mess, okay, yeah. because you've, you've less wet trades yeah. um, and uh, it, it's just a lot cleaner. Yeah, because you can't guarantee the weather here in Ireland, so. Exactly. So it's tech all wet trades. Well, with the speed as well, David, um, like you, you can start internal work after after day one. Yeah. So you have a structure up on uh, on day one. Depending on the weather, you can start your internal work, wait for a better day to start finishing the outside. So you're, you're never really held up on a job where you would be on conventional builds. You know? Yeah, I've gone out to a few jobs that some of the builders uh, yeah. have done. And even still now, I'm surprised how quick. quick yeah. goes. But even the homeowners, they go to work and come back. And the walls are up there. Exactly, yeah. Well, I think that's the biggest feedback, I think, isn't it, from, from homeowners? Yeah. That they, they go to work and they come home, there's actually a structure on the back of their house on day one. Yeah. So so they it's uh, uh, not three courses a block, yeah. and then another three courses a block, and then another three courses a block, you know? So, uh, and then it's uh, there's consistency as well. So uh, price can be guaranteed. Yeah. You know you know what you're getting. Because yeah. uh, um, every roof is, uh, every extension, sorry, is... Um, is consistent, yeah. you know, and uh, and obviously we have the certification and the reports to, to back all that up, you know. Yeah. And and the system is all delivered on one day, so we're not waiting for windows, we're not yeah. waiting for for bricks, yeah. like it's meant to be poured, like Absolutely. everything is delivered one day to the, to the, the contractor that's uh, doing the job for the yeah. homeowner. Yeah, and just going back to the thermal side of things, like, you know, there's jobs that we've done and in wintertime, yeah. and you see the full structure done and fully insulated, the roof fully insulated, um, I think it's 0.15 on the roof, 0.16 on the walls. Uh, on a frosty day, they could have the heating on all day and you'd still see the frost on the roof at 3 o'clock in the afternoon, which means there's no heat escaping at all from that from that roof, from that from that extension. Uh, the homeowners that have got some done have always said it's the warmest room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. It's, it really is. It really is, yeah. It really does do what it says in the tin, you yeah. know? Yeah. The other thing is just to notice, I say that we don't, uh, we get a lot of people ringing in, looking to, you know, for a Guardian Home Extension. Mm -hmm. But we are purely the supplier, yeah. uh, so we supply to registered builders. Yeah, yeah, it's 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 great that we have this certified installer scheme. Uh, full training goes with that. Uh, obviously, we do the, the proper checks on the companies as well before they, they go on to the registered installer scheme. Uh, so yeah, it's a it's a it's a win win, and uh, we we're also doing it in the UK, and we've a similar system over there as well, where we have credit installers that install the system there as well. One of the biggest thing that the homeowners always say to me is, uh, you know, what's the difference? Because Ireland is being tried and tested. It's always yeah. been bricks and mortar. Yeah. Every builder has done that. And, and it's, it's hard to change the mindset. And my always answer is, like, it's we're, like, it's it's not a, a cheaper system. We're not, we don't cut any corners. No. It's just a new way of doing extensions. Exactly. Exactly. It's definitely not cheaper. Um, it shouldn't be cheaper because, like, it is, as we said, more thermally efficient, more efficient than, than conventional build. Um, and then with all the certification that we have to go with it, we can prove that every single job that goes up around the country, we can stand over, both from a thermal point of view, structural point of view, everything. You know? yeah. And the way house prices are going now, uh, people, <coughs> you know, people are staying in the house longer. They're looking to, they're looking for that extra, yeah. extra, extra space. Whether they have kids, they have people yeah. coming back to safe houses or whatever it is, 
Um, and I suppose the thing we always say to our uh, installers that like our system can go as high as we wanted to go, yeah. but we really focus on you know forty square meters at the back of your house because you know one you don't need plan permission. Yeah. You know, which which slows a lot of things up as well. Absolutely. So, and there is hundreds of homeowners out there that just want that. Yeah. Break out that extra space. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Whether it's a playroom, a home office, a games room, whatever. You know. Uh, and you're right. People aren't moving at the moment, but they do need extra space. Yeah. And uh, keeping it on the back of your house, keeping it under forty square meters, obviously does get rid of that uh, planning permission stuff, uh, which which will obviously speed up the install as well. Yeah. So we manufacture the Guardian home extension here in Baldoyle. Um, we've got a, we've quite a number of factories here in Baldoyle, so we manufacture as much as we can. But the Guardian uh, extension was actually born out of one of our other products uh, we fabricated, which was the Guardian warm roof, which is probably the biggest on the market uh, in the UK for um, lightweight uh, replacement roofs for conservatives, etc. Yeah. So, Ross, you you you're heavily involved in yeah, that and yeah. how did that came the guardian home extension how did that all come about uh well it came about through our um, our partnership with kingspan and um, so uh, we use kingspan quite a bit in our warm roofs um, from an insulation point of view and they gave us a huge amount of support in the early days around uh, getting the correct u values how to test uh, the roof to make sure that it met the right standards particularly in the uk around building control and then Kingsman approached us probably, I'd say, could be nine, ten years ago now at this stage, where they just acquired a company that supply tech walls, which are the insulated uh, SIP panels that we, we, we use right now. Uh, but where they're slightly different uh, than the, the existing SIP panels that, say, are in the marketplace at the moment, they call their system a tech panel system. And the tech panel system is, is, is actually the bonding that is used to bond the insulation to the um, OSB board, which creates the wall. But it means that they can stand over their 25, 30 year warranty um, around delamination. They can guarantee uh, no warping, whereas other, maybe other SIP panel companies within, within uh, particularly the UK, but, but certainly you're, you're starting to see it now in Ireland as well, um, would have some issues like that. Whereas uh, obviously a, a company like Kingspan um, if, if, if they're going to bring a product to the to the marketplace, they're, they're going to make sure that they have the, the correct warranties and guarantees and everything else. So when they acquired uh, that company, they approached us from a, an, an extension point of view. Um, so they were doing quite a few sort of housing projects where you'd have two, three hundred houses on a on an estate. They do four or five story buildings with it, with with with, uh, with, te with tech panel as well but they couldn't get after the extension market. And because they are warm roof uh, is designed in particular to replace conservatory roofs. They're normally somewhere between 15, 20, up to 35, 40 square meter roofs, you know? So the guys that they were dealing with from the homeowner or the home building point of view, uh, obviously weren't interested in that smaller volume stuff, you yeah. know? So they approached us um, around basically marrying our roof with their walls yeah. and that's where guardian home extension came from so we from there we actually built a whole software package uh which we already had for the warm roof but we just combined the walls into our software package which allows us to basically draw up a roof fabricate it uh, sorry draw up an extension fabricate an extension and uh, supply drawings to the customers, to the builders, to the architects, whatever whatever needs to be. So that's that's basically where it came from. Was a was the partnership with Kingspan in the first place, you know. So yeah, yeah and the back of the, uh, I was just seeing the picture there. Obviously, and, and Kingspan is a is a household name and, yeah. and carries a good bit of weight. So I suppose being partnered with them was you know pretty yeah. pretty deal pretty pretty big deal. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, and we're one of the only part companies partnering up in, in Ireland, Kingspan? In Ireland, yes, for, for uh, producing the panels, yeah. So we actually produce the panels for our UK business here in Dublin as well. Yeah. Um, so our factory is on the go pretty much every day. Uh, we're, we're hoping at some stage this year it, it may even get to sort of two shifts because we're, we're, we're incredibly busy with it. Yeah. Um, just talking about partnerships as well, actually, Velux have also partnered up with us on the back of the home extension coming to the marketplace as well. Uh, obviously, Velux would be probably known as the number one yeah. roof window in the world, for probably that matter. You think of roof windows, you think yeah. of Velux. Exactly. Yeah. Of course, yeah, that's what, that's what everyone 
when they, when they do try and mention a roof window, Velox seems to be the name that, that everyone mentions. So it was great to be approached by them guys as well. Uh, My thoughts behind that is that like, they obviously see some weight in this product because, you know, I could be, you know, biased on this or whatever, mm-hmm. but they're not going to stick their names. Kingspan and Velox are not going to want to team up with, you know, we're not as big as them, let's be honest. No, but I think I think it's the fact that we've done everything correct the whole way ro- along and right. Okay, yeah. so even when we brought our warm roof system into whether it was England, Wales, Scotland, Ireland, okay, we we done individual test reports for each of them areas, okay, just to make sure that we met, we met all the correct uh, building control uh, regulations, yeah. regulations that, yeah. you, that 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 you would have in the different areas, and and it is amazing, right? There's different ones in every area, yeah. so. Uh, we obviously indep- independently test everything as well, yeah. uh, which which really helps. And we do all that through the BRE, which would be um, a, a massive testing company for, for all European companies um, or systems for that matter. And I think the fact that we've did that the whole way along uh, and we're an incredibly strong brand as it is, yeah. um, I, th- I think that's why the likes of Kingspan and Velox would like to would like to work with us. You know, we're, yeah. No, it is very exciting. Mm. I suppose back to the main question then. So... In you know, in the here in Ballon, just to say, we manufacture our aluminium, aluminium, uh, lift and slide bifolds, and we do you know windows for the extension. Also, we're in control of that. Absolutely. We cut the extension walls here. Yep. And we manufacture the guardian warm roof and the flat roof here. Yep. So, so we've every angle covered from from extension point of view. So some people want a flat roof, as you said. Some yeah. people might want a pitched roof. Some people want Velox windows in a roof. Some people want a lantern on a flat roof. Yeah. And uh, we're starting to see now is a, is a bit of a switch probably from PVC windows and doors to aluminium. Yeah. And we're lucky enough that we actually fabricate an aluminium system here as well, whether it's lift and slide doors or bifold doors. So as you said earlier on, David, like, you know, like the, we can deliver nearly the whole package. Like it's literally 80% of the roof, 85% sorry, of the extension is actually arriving on site in one hit. And just, for a just builder. For the it's, and so... For it's a builder, idea. stop saying going to the hardware every five minutes. And yeah. time is the biggest thing. And any builder will tell you, time yeah. is the biggest thing. They've the pain driving around the place and the traffic around Dublin Absolutely. is is and anyone yeah. that's listening to this from Dublin will know yeah. it's not easy to get around with, especially through rush hour traffic and kids getting yeah. off school and so yeah. for us to be able to deliver all this on site at one go yeah um, and that's right down to all the fixings okay because there's certain fixings that we supply because we need to make sure that the correct fixings are being used whether it's in a wall or whether it's in the roof uh because again we've structurally tested everything and uh we 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 supply right down to the nuts bolts screws nails whatever it is like you know so uh so yeah it's a it's a one-stop shop for the builders really you know yeah, no, it no, it is fantastic. Mm. So, uh, and the amount of calls we're getting in coming in, people looking for, uh, for builders go out and price, uh, price their jobs yeah. because mm. I, I always come back to me any homeowner that you know it comes on and they're mm. they're they're saying how how they couldn't believe just how quick the extension went up. Absolutely, yeah, absolutely. Uh, well, that's always the feedback is the more the most positive feedback is the speed. So, if you're looking at it from a builder's point of view, okay, and we've had build we have builders going off us now where they've been conventional builders all their life, which is blocks mortar cutting in a roof and having to cut everything i found off, so. right, sorry i found yeah. right getting a builder in a traditional builder that has been doing like you said bricks and mortar forever yeah. and there's nothing wrong with that system yeah. it's tried and tested through yeah. for years hundreds of years yeah absolutely. all right to actually get them over the line i found was they had to get one done yeah and once they got one done that's it the system actually done the talking rather than me saying just try the system will you it's going to work it's absolutely it's, absolutely uh, like see there's there's a, there's a couple of positives to it as well from a say a sales point of view for from a builder's yeah. point of view um so most builders would probably be able to do depending on how many crews they have on the road yeah. maybe five or six conventional extensions within a year yeah you know just from the length of time that it takes you know where they can double that potentially even two and a half times more with our with our system within a year okay so if you put that into numbers right so if a builder's i don't know they turn over a million in a year okay yeah. with the same cost base using our system they could actually turn over 2 million a year or 2.2, 2.3 million. So if they do you know, five so extensions, they could do 10. It, it's just, In, yeah, from a business case study point of view, yeah. like that's just the simple figures of it all. Like, you know, yeah. So just to wrap it up, Roy, so if you're a homeowner, the homeowner gets the extension done, in half the time, half the time, get more space, more bang for the book as it costs, it gives more space. Absolutely. Yeah. Less mess. Yes. Get the house and everything back to normal as quick as possible. Yeah. And if a bit, for a builder's point of view, they're in and out quicker on to the next job. 
Yes, but and they're also getting a consistent system, okay? And that's from a thermal point of view and a structural point of view. Yeah. Uh, particularly the thermal side of things because, uh, as you know, the, the world's gone very green now. Yeah. Um, and uh, the, the fact that I touched on earlier on that we independently test all our systems from a, a U-value point of view, a condensation risk point of view, the homeowner just has comfort in knowing, right, that that, that structure that's gone on the back of their house, right, our roof is 0.15, it is 0.15. Yeah. The walls are 0.16. The walls are 0.16. Most conventional jobs gone up and builders putting up conventional jobs probably really don't have an idea of what their actual insulation is in the walls or the roof for that matter. Yeah. Okay. So it's consistency with our system basically. You know? And I suppose the homeowner, even though um, ultimately the, the contract is with the uh, the builder that's doing the work for the homeowner, but the homeowner must take some comfort in it that, you know, we're around nearly 40 years. Yeah. You know, uh, we're not going anywhere. No, nope. uh, we're growing all the time, so it's not. It's all manufactured here in in Bad Oil Industrial Estate. Absolutely. So, like, like, and let's be honest, a homeowner could be spending. They could try their remortgaging. Yeah. You know, they're getting a loan. Yeah. They're, you know, a lot of savings on it. Like, it's yeah. a big deal to put. You know, between fifty, a hundred, whatever, whatever yeah. looking they get done to the house. So it's it's yeah. it's serious investment. Absolutely. And it's yeah. not a decision, uh, they make quickly. And I find actually that once a builder goes out to see a, to see a homeowner. The time the homeowner comes back with the drawings to us, and we met, we do it all up, give it back to the builder. Mm. It, it does it's a process. Yeah, it is like, definitely, definitely. Yeah, there's a couple of things we've done actually just to help the homeowner and help the builder for that matter. Is that uh, even our even our brochure we've designed for the for the system, for the home extension system. Um, we've sort of given them ideas. So we've we've done like five scenarios of say you, if you want a utility room, a play room, a social space, an office space, and we give them ideas of what. The roof should look like what the walls should look like where their windows and doors should be okay, so yeah. that that has always been feedback that we get from from builders and from homeowners for that matter yeah. homeowners know that they want an extension yeah they just don't know what they want yeah. you know and then builders are saying they go to homeowners and they spend so much time sitting in the house basically and maybe a week or two goes past because between the two of them they're trying to work out what each other what, what they want yeah yeah whereas we've now given ideas of of what the homeowner will need the builder can nearly price it on the night because he has an idea or she has an idea yeah. of um of, of what they're already looking for yeah. so uh so we're, we're sort of helping that sales process along the way as well yeah no it's uh i have to say it's very exciting mm -hmm. uh, even starting off this year mm -hmm. uh the amount of, of of builders that have been in and amount of builders actually trying to get on the framework at the moment yeah yeah uh so uh no yeah no it's very exciting yeah, we uh, we hold training days here. Yeah. Uh, I think we've one coming up now on the thirtieth of January, yeah. and we've got probably eight to ten builders from. Uh, actually, we're, we're branching even outside of uh, Leinster at the moment. Yeah. I think there's builders coming from Cork, Kerry, all over the all over the country to come to one of our training days. Uh, we we uh, to become a credit installer, you, you you would have to complete one of our training days. We also supply a force fit assist. And um, after that happens, then you 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 can go on to the accredited installer list, and yeah. uh, obviously leads would be would be sent your way from from us that we, we generate. We will only ever send a lead to uh, to an accredited installer, yeah. uh, someone that's uh, officially trained, and have gone through that process. Yeah, hmm. yeah, and I think for the homeowner as well, uh, they if they want, they should price traditional and and things like you know, and if they want a second price, uh, they can do it. Um, but just to to. The concrete is that we're only the suppliers here. Uh, their contract is, is with the builders because, yeah. uh, P, you know, because we're pushing, obviously talking so well about our system and all, it, it's only natural that a homeowner rings us looking to see if we supply and fit, uh, and we don't. So, but they can contact us and we can give them a registered installer. And it's it's ultimately their decision if they want to go, you know, or if they yeah. want to see another one or... Yeah, it's the same with all the systems that we do at the end of the day, okay? So there's a there's a product guarantee and a product, product warranty and yeah. a fabrication warranty with it with with everything that we do and produce here yeah. and the products that we sell but there's just, there's a huge amount of work that needs to be done as well outside of that yeah, so there's yeah. groundwork that the builders need to do yeah. uh, the homeowner might want to knock out because they want to extend their kitchen into the extension and yeah. stuff like that so the, the contract is always with the builder yeah it's not with us but like we you know we we work so close with the builders we, we have an unbelievable backup system yeah, here do, yeah. but yeah. uh but yeah like the contract is ultimately with the installer at the end of the day all right, okay, well, listen, thanks very much, Ross. Oh, thank you.